If you are looking for the best single player releases, then you are in the right video. So without wasting time, let's start the video with Kang Lung City, an open world RPG in development by Yeying Game Studio, which promises to transport players to a world inspired by ancient China, full of mysteries, legends, and epic battles. Initially conceived as a mod for Skyrim, the project has evolved into an independent game. Although the game has been in development for a good while, everything indicates that it will probably be released at some point in 2025. Now we just have to hope that it won't be cancelled. Next single player is Pragmata Game developed by Capcom, first announced in June 2020 during the PlayStation 5 presentation. Since its announcement, the game has generated a lot of expectations, but also a good dose of mystery, as few details have been revealed so far. The game is set in a dystopian future, and features an astronaut and a girl, although the specific plot has not been fully disclosed yet. Pragmata has already suffered several delays since its announcement, However, it is expected that the game will be released in 2025. The Witcher 4, also known as Project Polaris, is the next game in the famous franchise developed by CD Projekt Red. The game will involve about 400 developers in the project, indicating a large scale of production. The game will be developed using the Unreal Engine 5, promising significant innovations in terms of graphics and gameplay. The developer has high expectations for The Witcher 4, promising that the game will push the boundaries of RPG even after the challenges faced with the release of Cyberpunk 2077. Lost Soul Aside is an action RPG and hack and slash game that has been in development for some time and is finally approaching its release. The story of Lost Soul Aside revolves around Kazer, a swordsman who finds himself fused with a symbiotic supernatural race called Arena. Lost Soul Aside is a fast-paced and frenetic action game, focusing on intense combat and insane combos. The game features a combo-based combat system, allowing players to execute attacks with special abilities to defeat their enemies. For fans of classic RPGs, the name Gothic is synonymous with immersion and freedom. Originally released in 2001, the game has gained a loyal following with its dark medieval atmosphere, challenging combat system, and open world full of possibilities. Now, after years of waiting, THQ Nordic is about to release the highly anticipated remake, promising to bring back the magic of the original with modern graphics and significant improvements. One of the highlights of the remake is the promise of a more complex life simulation, where the game world continues to exist even when the player is not present.
Stalker 2 Heart of Chornable is a first-person shooter game that combines elements of survival horror, developed and published by GSC Game World, a Ukrainian developer. This title is the sequel to the acclaimed Stalker series and marks the first release in 15 years. The game is set in the Chernobyl Exclusion Zone, a post-apocalyptic environment full of dangers, including threatening enemies, lethal anomalies, and powerful artifacts. Players will have the opportunity to explore this vast area while uncovering secrets of the game. Clockwork Revolution is a first-person action RPG with steampunk elements and a time travel mechanic. The game takes place in Avalon, a steam-powered metropolis that hides a dark secret. Its history has been meticulously shaped through alterations in the past. The player takes on the role of a protagonist who discovers a device that allows time travel. Through this invention, he discovers that Avalon was created through manipulations of historical events, raising questions about the nature of reality and the true purpose of the city. Seeking lost glory, and for what? Alterborn is a game that combines elements from different genres, including Souls-like, Roguelite, and Looter Shooter. It was developed by Iron Lung, a team of developers from Warsaw with experience in renowned companies like Ubisoft and Techland. The game is a third-person shooter set in a world called Shattered Lands, where players take on the role of an alterborn, a survivor marked by a mysterious plague. The environment is described as dark and unforgiving, challenging players to decide between preserving their humanity or abandoning it. people just like us seeking a better life good day to you sir or madam let me be the first all i ask is what every mother wants. new arc line is a new turn-based single-player rpg being developed by the ukrainian studio dreamate the game is set in a fictional world that combines elements of arcane magic and steampunk revolution players will have the opportunity to choose a side in the conflict between these two worlds influencing the balance between sorcery elves dwarves and mysterious monsters on one side, and steampunk devices, zeppelins, and Tesla weapons on the other. Fans of games that value narrative and player choice will certainly have much to look forward to from this title. To finish, we have the highly anticipated Metal Gear Solid Delta Snake Eater remake of one of the most acclaimed games in the Metal Gear Solid franchise. This new version promises updated graphics, enhanced gameplay, and an even deeper immersion into the world of espionage and stealth action created by Hideo Kojima. The main feature of Delta is the complete visual update. The dense jungle and iconic scenarios of the original game will be recreated with much more detail than the original version. The development team promises a smoother and more intuitive experience, with refined controls and new mechanics that fit seamlessly into the Metal Gear universe. Well that was the video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and until next time.